welcome to the lifestyles of the strange and exotic hysterically funny haul and I went today because it was Wednesday it was dollar day and did errands which always lets me end up at the will and I managed to have like a <laughs> the lady that I'm the hair guru for we had like a interesting conversation so I grabbed a few odds and ends of course I was <laughs> in what was just in the last haul the, the luggage she's like oh well you're going on a trip and I'm like no I'm, I'm actually just moving in since I'm here at the will all the time I figured I'd just stay <laughs> this is the random pile from today and previously beyond shopping so the first thing I got was this and I, I think it's like a Nintendo DS or I don't know what what you use this case for <laughs> and then Chris is like, oh, it's so you, and I'm like, yeah, think. So for $2, I got kind of a nice hardcover case, and I was kind of hoping my portable hard drive would go in here, and it does fit. There's room for the cord, too, so that is awesome. So that's why I got that. But there's no anything that even says made in China. But it's good. It fit, and it worked, and it was awesome for 2 bucks. Must have came with, like, a handle or something, but perfect. And the next thing I got, I got today at the library for a whopping dollar bill. <laughs> and <laughs> I didn't even think of looked to see if it was in there. Yep. And it's the video guide to hummingbirds. And over here we have a hummingbird feeder that now the ants decided to find enjoyable. And it goes featuring a hundred different species. Which I didn't realize there were that many versions of hummingbirds. So and and I'm sitting here, you hear this like mini, you know, Apache helicopter. I'm like, boy, that's one big-ass bug. And you look over, and it was a hummingbird. Didn't stay to eat or anything. He just sort of buzzed and haven't seen him since. So I should, so this should be fairly interesting, and you may or may not get a review just so I can have something in the lineup. <laughs> so, for a buck. That was cool. And this you will get a review on, so I won't say too much about it. But, <laughs> I loved it. And it's a <laughs> Stickman's really bad day and all the signs in here are legit signs so this was 50 cents so you will be getting a review and what else I got here? Oh, okay and the next thing I got for a, um, either 50 cents or a dollar I can't remember if it was half off or not there was only like seven of them in here but tea lights and these are even bigger than the ones that I had originally so you're paying if you get like the big bag, you're looking at less than half of this size now. So, and I, you know, once I use up the candle, I use the reuse this part and just remake my tea lights because I like the big ones because they last a little longer, you know, whatever. So I picked this up and it was Kendall Craft. Tea lights and metal cups, burning time up to five hours. Mm, don't know if it depends on the wax or not, so... Yes, so these are even bigger than the ones I thought were huge that I was using, so yes! So I reused these, I was very, very happy. Actually, I could just pop that off and redo that, so... Yep. And they smell... Like somebody had them with perfumes, or somebody spilled perfume on it. Because it smells really, really nice! Mm. <laughs> It smells, it smells like a high-class old lady. <laughs> and the next thing in the pile was awesome. I got this Day Runner for $3. And I was looking for like the pages and they wanted like 30 bucks for the planner itself. And I'm like, mm. <laughs> so I got this for three, which helped a lot because I'm trying to keep my grandmother's stuff straight, and then my stuff straight, and blah, blah, blah. So this came in really handy, but I actually bought this for the pages. Because if you go into, like, if you go into Subway, if you go into Staples, they want, like, ten bucks just for a package of this stuff. So, this I paid three dollars for. Helps a lot. So now I've got my book, her book. And I switched between the two for, like, the different the stuff that I wanted and the stuff that I wanted in hers. So it worked out awesome. So for three bucks, I've been very happy. 
So I wanted more pages, and they had this for a dollar. So it was either 50 cents or a dollar. I can't remember if it was half off or not. And it was a package of 50 sheets of just plain lined pages. They had a few that were like smaller still, but this is the size I wanted. So I picked that up. Well, where the hell did this come from? Well, they wanted four bucks for this particular one. God knows where. But still, really? Four bucks for 50 sheets? I don't think so. You paid that much for a ream of paper. So, yep. And what I, I did manage to find a few on like Pinterest that I can print up myself since this is basically eight and a half by 11 folded over. But I use this as a template for the holes. So it came in handy. I was glad to get it. Figured I'd pick it up while it was there. And the last thing I picked up was, <laughs> and this was for $2. I'm pretty sure this was regular price. 25 different genuine stamps commemorating Sir Winston Churchill. And I sort of inherited like my grandparents, grandfather's stamps. And I'm, you know, a history buff, World War II especially, so this was really, really cool. And they're all in there. There's actually one extra that I guess somebody got the mail from or something. So I actually got, to, what, 23 of them? Nope, 26. All different, which is true. And they came out of some Arabic country. And the stamps are really kind of cool. There's the stamps there. And I, I don't know where these came originally, or how much they would have been originally. But very cool for my collection. And Sir Winston is pretty awesome. So that is my goodies for this or go around anyways. So now I'll get on to doing my book reviews as the neighbors are looking out. Why is she talking to herself? <laughs> well, it could be yelling, I suppose. So thank you for watching. Do remember to comment, rate, share, and subscribe. There's always room for one more at the Strange and Exotic. See you next time. Bye. Mm -hmm.